This year marks the 50th anniversary of the first international conference on Arabidopsis research held in Göttingen in Germany. The first cited Arabidopsis paper in the Thomson Reuters Biosys database was from 1927 by O.E. Schultz on crucifers found in mountains, entitled Beiträge zur Kenntnis der Kruziferen des nordwestlichen Himalaya-Gebirges. Since the adoption of Arabidopsis as a model plant in the 1970s and 80s by a small group of pioneers such as George Rede, Martin Cornif, Chris Somerville, and Elliot Meyerowitz, Arabidopsis research has exploded with more than 54,000 publications covering 406 different fields, such as enzymes, cytology, the reproductive system of plants, and others. As part of a review of these past 50 years for the new phytologist, we have built an interactive explorer of the Arabidopsis literature. Some papers have been cited a few times, and some papers have been cited many times. The most highly cited paper is the Clow and Bent 1998 floral dip method. A third of the papers have been cited by non-Arabidopsis researchers. These are represented by the green bars here. The yearly impact outside of Arabidopsis research increases for older papers. This means Arabidopsis is having a huge impact in plant biology. As most of you are aware, many firsts were discovered in Arabidopsis. First plant genome in 2000, genome-wide tDNA collections, elucidation of hormone pathways, networks of floral homeotic genes, environmental responses, and many others. For an overview of the past 50 years of Arabidopsis research, see our new phytologist review. We also discuss where the field is going over the next 50 years.